and I'm out going out to do some shopping I want to show you the location of my uh, place so this is my building I'm there on the third floor I have a gambling place there it's only for uh, placing bets like a sports book on this corner really good bank and the medical institution this was some office building but they converted it and now they have everything there doctors uh, specialists uh, uh, labs for tests and everything so it's when I need it it's there by the house down there that's the bank that I use for banking on this corner we have a little restaurant here are some shops and money exchange that's the money exchange place they also do Western Union so it's really good all the time public transport going this this is one of the most important street it's called Tsara Dushana which means Emperor Dushan he was the ruler of Serbia in 14th century he died uh, 1355 something on a location of this my house it is really good location excellent this building where i live if you go up just four or five blocks there's the downtown the main street everything is there shopping theaters movies everything that way like uh, three bl blocks there's a big farmer's market i'm going to show you that later and like I said, this way, it's towards the Belgrade Fortress, maybe four blocks. So we are one block from my house. You can see some new construction on both corners of the street. This whole area, this whole street was just small, small buildings like that on the corner or like this one, just uh, one floor just ground level hardly ever you had the floor above now they're building this you can see one two three four five floors maybe more and the problem is parking there's no garage around there's no parking places and the biggest problem for this city is parking you can see cars parked on the sidewalks everywhere there's no garage there's no parking uh, lots, there's nothing. These old buildings, they even don't have a garage, nothing. Uh, you can see now those buildings that are four, five, six floors. <laughs> Each floor, three or four apartments. How many cars is that? And no garage, no parking. It's getting worse. And that's the biggest problem for this city. The city is divided in zones and this is the worst one. The main one, number one and you're there get the maybe two hour parking you have to use the phone app to pay and then after two hours you have to move you cannot add more money nope you have to move you're done so all your visits shopping and everything has be to be within two hours so next to the new construction you can see some of those small buildings there still exist there one of them it's a laptop and desk desktop uh, uh, service so computer store then it's a bakery bakery and then little restaurant it says uh, home cooking so that may be good and next to them you this is interesting that building has a garage and a space for rent and it has one two three four five six seven floors next to it liquor discount store liquor store i had to visit one day get that uh, serbian plum brandy there's a couple of smaller stores and then there's the one where I'm going in this is uh, called Big Bite and uh, it's a couple older ladies 
they started the business cooking so like home cooking you just come pick it up take it home next to it uh, this is real estate agency so you can buy apartment in Belgrade so let's see what we're gonna eat today and you can see here it says uh, salad soup grill cook cook meals breakfast everything you can check it out on the website This all looks good. And here it is. I'll show you later. I got that's all together is ten dollars. I think it's a good price for Americans. For locals, I don't know. Next door, like I said, you can see a real estate agency. Next to real estate agency, another place where you can take the food out I see here hot dogs ribs burgers I still had to try it and next to it uh, hair salon I'm gonna need a haircut soon another that uh, currency exchange place you see people come with money all kinds it's not just tourists, it's locals. This is a high school here, technical for wood processing, for carpenters and uh, furniture makers. Across the street, it's interesting, you see the blue awning there? That's the place that sells the fish, grilled, cooked, all kinds. And across the street, supermarket. There are several chains around the town, this one is called Idea. And let's see what we can get there. So the guy stopped and he said mask. These girls don't wear masks. So you can see there's everything, raspberries, kiwi, fruit. It looks like regular American store. Also has a deli. All kind of cheese looks like something you get in your and this is the excellent cheese it's some kind of creamy feta cheese excellent you can see milk yogurt buttermilk everything eggs there's a bakery over there's deli and a lot of stuff here is organic. To just show you quick uh, that we have everything available we have some foreign beers and some uh, Stella and this is one of the best local beers lion love Italian Peroni 
really good beer. This is excellent local beer, Zaječarsko. And Jelen, you know Jelen from my videos. And this is probably the best. And that's probably the best, Nikšićko. Okay, let's go home and eat. And as you can see, our shopping is really good here. And uh, this was small uh, grocery store, small uh, supermarket. All these uh, uh, stores, they have everything, like I said, like in America. If you come to live in Belgrade, you're not gonna miss anything. But we have something that you don't have at home. Farmer's market. You're gonna love it. And I'm back home, so let me show you what did I buy for lunch and dinner. So, like I said, for uh, thousand, 1100 dinners, which is uh, uh, like $10, $1 is uh, 100 dinners, so that is $10. I have uh, stuffed peppers, two medium-sized peppers, then I have... Uh, wheel schnitzel with uh, mashed potatoes and cabbage for salad. I think for $10, this is good. $5 for a meal, just buy bread. And uh, that's not expensive. Think about it. You don't have to go shopping. You don't have to prepare or cook food or something. For single guy, you don't need better solution than this. Fresh cooked meal every day. That's good stuff. Yeah. This across the street, all this to that corner. And going down one block, the whole square thing is farmer's market. We're gonna visit farmer's market in Belgrade. So there are people selling everything here junk this is the meat shop sausage so this is like 70 cents for uh, apples, grapes, $2.50 for two pounds, because this is one kilogram, kilogram, that's 2.2 pounds, 250, that is dirt cheap. Mushrooms. Odakle je paradajz? Ozbiljno. Nije iz Grčke. Za sto dinara iz Grčke. Čekaj, ali mora da ti da zvanično. Pa da. 50 cents for more than pound of tomatoes. And from the farm. This is not your frozen from Mexico. Area only cheese. All kinds of cheese, smoked meat. Have tasting? Yeah, можно, можно. Yeah. So, I got some cheese, kaimak, and uh, tomatoes. I need some peppers, but there's everything. Here's young artist, starving artist at the farmer's market. And this place is huge. You have no idea. I just cannot walk all around. Too much for my age. Thank you. 
corn. This is all natural, organic. Oh, these are. Oh. <laughs> so they're just little shop from the farmer's market. It's really close to my house, just uh, three blocks or one uh, station with a bus. So easy access. Here, I'm done shopping. Going now for refreshment. So I'm here with the old high school buddy. He also did some shopping. We now came here for refreshment. This is the closest, closest to farmer's market. Little Carp, that's the name of the place, Little Carp. This is nothing fancy here. There's only five tables, so it's not a big place. Uh, it's probably for local alcoholics. Yeah. And here's the lost art of uh, rolling your own tobacco. And the final product. The guys that smoke pot, they know for this, but this is nice. Domestic Serbian tobacco, no chemicals. No perfumes, no magnesium, no HMO, GMO. On je de burek, boli njega patka. And živeli. My old buddy from high school. The first guy that I got drunk together with in 1967. <laughs> but yeah. Yes, yes, yeah, right. September. We went on some uh, trip together, the whole class. And, you know, first time rules, drinking, smoking, everything. Traveling. I'm on the planet when it's here. What is it? No, it's not. Ah, you, I'm looking at it. So, manufacturing. Here in Belgrade, in Serbia, everybody speaks English. And most signs on the stores are in English. Look at this. Green at the uh, cafe. Or the bookstore is labeled bookstore. So whenever you come here, it's going to be easy for you to roam around and know what's what. Or here, Balkan bet. That's like a sports book. You can place bets on... Uh, Various games, usually soccer games in Europe. And the bank in Serbian is banka, but it's same thing, same spelling, bank. So it's now about 3.30 in the afternoon, Sunday. I'm up there on the third floor, got back home. Seven o'clock, Packers, Bears game. <laughs> it's gonna be hilarious. Bears suck big time. So long and good luck.